So we took off at approximately 10 o'clock in the morning, Hawaii Standard Time, on the 3rd of June, 2018, to do an aerial uh, reconnaissance of the Kapoho Vacation Land area and the Fisher 8 Lava Flow and Leilani Estates. Uh, we were also on a search and rescue to see if uh, there were any people still in the Kapoho Vacation Land area that um, we had seen from last night that were stuck and couldn't get out. What we saw this morning was uh, a very wide flow, um, about, you could say, 400 to 600 yards wide uh, that had slowed from last night. I thought uh, the flow would have reached the ocean by this morning, but it was still about three to 400 yards from the very front of Kapoho Bay, um, that's uh, a good thing because it's slowing. It can also be a bad thing because it's widening. And if it continues to push forward, um, then it'll it'll mean that it'll uh, take a wider um, destructive path on its on its way to the ocean. So it's about 300 uh, to 400 yards from the ocean as of 10:30 uh, this morning on Sunday. Uh, we also went up to Fisher Eight uh, to take a look at that. That uh, was still putting out an incredible amount of lava uh, it wasn't as high as the 200 to 250 foot height fountain that we'd seen in the past uh, today's fountain probably 150 maybe 200 feet max but still what was very noticeable was an incredible amount of lava um, downslope of Fisher 8 um, in the area of the PGV plant and south of the PGV plant that was an actively flowing lava river that was flowing south uh, towards Kapo.